There have been several tsunamis throughout history. It has long caused coastal areas to suffer, and it continues to remain a threat in many regions of the world. In the past 20 years, there have been many most devastating tsunamis. Here are the top five tsunamis in recorded history. Number one, Haiti tsunami. On Tuesday, January 12, 2010, at 1653 local time, a powerful 7.0 magnitude earthquake hit Haiti. The tsunami also reached Virgin Islands, Dominican Republic. The devastating January 12 earthquake in Haiti also set off a swarm of unusual tsunamis, which killed three and destroyed several homes. Though surveying damage and rescuing survivors was of utmost priority for several weeks, scientists are now starting to examine some of the side effects of the Tembler, such as the tsunamis. The waves, which averaged about 10 feet, 3 meters, high, slammed shores along the Bay of port au prince and the southern coast of the island of Hispaniola, which is shared by Haiti and the Dominican Republic. At least one wave hit the shore as far as 62 miles, 100 kilometers, away from the earthquake's epicenter, near port au prince Haiti. Tsunamis are rare though not unheard of in the Caribbean. A 1946 wave in the Dominican Republic killed nearly 2,000 people, said Herman Fritz, a civil and coastal engineer who worked with a team from Haiti's Quisquaya University to study the tsunamis. Yet the Haiti tsunami swarm was unusual, since earthquakes usually need to be bigger than the recent magnitude 7.0 quaked to spawn the killer waves, said Fritz, whose team will present its findings Wednesday at the American Geophysical Union's Ocean Sciences meeting in Portland, Oregon. Number 2. Tohoku Tsunami, Japan, March 11, 2011 One of the worst tsunamis ever recorded struck the Japanese shoreline on March 11, 2011. The waves were about 500 miles per hour and measured at 32 feet, 10 meters, in height. This massive tsunami was brought on by an earthquake that lasted six minutes. Common names for it include Great East Japan Earthquake. Since the beginning of modern record keeping in the 1900s, it was the fourth strongest earthquake ever to be recorded. Sadly, the affected area's people, who were largely in coastal towns, had terrifyingly little time to get out of the wave's impact zone. Even though, areas used for evacuation were seriously impacted and some of them were completely submerged. According to official reports, there were 19,747 deaths and 2,556 reported missing persons in 2021. High waves induced by the earthquake and the ensuing tsunami led to the Fukushima Daiichi nuclear accident. Its three reactors all melted down, releasing radioactive discharge. This resulted in additional evacuations and had an impact on thousands of local residents. Amounts lost as a result of the earthquake ranged from $14.05 to $34.6 billion. It is frequently regarded to be the historically most expensive natural disaster. Number 3. Sumatra, Indonesia, 26 December 2004. The depth at which the 9.1 magnitude earthquake off the coast of Sumatra occurred was assessed to be 30 kilometers. The seafloor was vertically displaced along the 1300 kilometers fault zone that generated the tsunami by several meters. As much as 50 meters tall, the ensuing tsunami reached 5 kilometers inland at Nubola, Sumatra. With approximately 1,000 combined tide gauge and eyewitness measurements from throughout the world, including locations in the U.S., the UK and Antarctica. This tsunami is also the most widely reported. The disaster is blamed for approximately $10 billion in damages and is thought to have killed about 230,000 people. The magnitude 9.1 Sumatra, Indonesia earthquake on December 26, 2004 produced a tsunami that was seen throughout the world and left a terrible trail of destruction and fatalities in the Indian Ocean region. The third largest earthquake on record since 1900 severely damaged and killed people in northern Sumatra, Indonesia, and the Nicobar Islands, India. Since the tsunami occurred within 20 minutes of the earthquake, there is no distinct death toll for the earthquake. The death toll was probably less than 1,000 which was comparable to the earthquake that occurred on March 28, 2005. 
more individuals were murdered by the ensuing tsunami than any previous tsunami in history, with 227,898 people either dead or missing. Indonesia was the hardest devastated nation, with 167,540 people reported dead or missing and 4,451.6 million dollars in property damage. Sri Lanka, 35,322. India, 16,269. Thailand, 8,212. Somalia, 289. The Maldives, 108. Malaysia, 75. Myanmar, 61. Tanzania, 13. Bangladesh, 2. The Seychelles, 2. South Africa, 2. Yemen, 2. And Kenya, 1. Were the other countries that saw deaths. $10 billion in insured losses and $2 billion in material losses were the overall estimated losses in the Indian Ocean region. Number 4. Aleutian Tsunami 1946. In the Alaskan Aleutian Islands, an earthquake struck at 1229 Greenwich Mean Time on April 1, 1946. The earthquake, which had a surface wave magnitude of 7.8, an epicenter at 52.8 degrees north, 163.5 degrees west, and a focal depth of 25 kilometers, caused a tsunami that affected the whole Pacific. More than 165 people lost their lives and more than $26 million, 1946 USD, in damage were caused by the tsunami before it vanished. On Unimac Island in Alaska, the recently constructed Scotch Cap Lighthouse was one of the buildings harmed by the tsunami. Five men lost their life at the lighthouse, and the run-up was 35.0 meters. One of the areas where the tsunami was most devastating was the Hawaiian Islands. On the island of Hawaii, Palolo Valley recorded the highest run-up at 12.0 meters. On the island of Hawaii, Hello was the city that suffered the most damage. The tsunami's run-up was measured at 8.1 meters, and it reached Hilo 4.9 hours after leaving the Aleutian Islands. 96 people died and Hilo sustained damage of $26 million. Hawaii had not received a warning since the tsunami warning system was not yet in place. All the islands were severely damaged by the tsunami, but Hawaii Island was particularly hard hit. A sequence of six to seven big tsunami waves that arrived at intervals of 15 to 20 minutes pounded the town of Hilo on the Hawaiian island of Hawaii. The tallest of these waves rose 8.1 meters above sea level during their run-up. There was significant destruction. The coastline of Hilo was completely destroyed by the waves, which killed 159 people there. Each home on the major road that ran across the Hilo Bay had been pulled from its foundation and thrown across the street, slamming into the structures on the other side. Number 5. Northern Chile 13 August 1868 One of the most powerful earthquakes ever recorded. The Erika earthquake of 1868 was a megaquake that occurred on August 13, 1868, in the city of Erika, which is now in Chile, but was then part of Peru. It had a Richter scale value of 9.0. The 1868 earthquake was one of the strongest of the 19th century and one of the most violent to ever occur in Chile, a seismically active region. For the initial fault, a rupture that measured at least 600 kilometers in length and 150 kilometers in width was calculated. Historical data indicates that the seismic event lasted a few minutes. The earthquake, which also gave rise to a devastating tsunami, was felt around 3,000 kilometers of shoreline from Lima to Valdivia and throughout much of modern-day Bolivia. Any questions regarding this let us know in the comments section. If you like my videos please hit the like button, subscribe and click on the bell notification so you do not miss out on any opportunities.